Weok CEO Gregory George says fuel prices in Antigua and Barbuda vary based on changes in the government's fuel consumption tax or the product price for Weok's refined fuel imports. George says the recent rise in fuel prices is due entirely to increases in the price of the imported fuel. The CEO says the war in Ukraine and other global factors have led to demand far outstripping supply for oil-based products. But what has happened and what is, what is unprecedented is that for the first time we are seeing crude prices not at record levels but the prices at the pump at record levels. George says this is because refineries have significantly increased their profit margins. The refiners are essentially printing money at this time. Their margins are very high because of the supply and demand, a lack of, of, of refining capacity, a lot of refineries have closed down. So I can give you numbers, for example. A year ago, the refiner's margin was in the region of about $9 uh, a, a barrel. Today, fast forward a year, it's in excess of $43 a barrel. So it's gone up, what, over four times. And the same thing in diesel, even worse. Diesel, you're looking at a price, a refining margin of, of, of $6 a year ago, you're looking at approximately $51 today. The result, drivers all over the world paying more at the pumps, even though unrefined oil is cheaper than years ago. Looking at our situation in Antigua, you can go back to May 2011, for example, where a barrel of crude was in the region of $140 a barrel, but our cost of bringing the product in, our product price was in approximately $11 EC per gallon. Fast forward to June 2022, where the world price, the crude price, is $120 a barrel, but yet our cost of bringing product into Antigua per gallon is in excess of $14 a gallon. Over the past few months, the Antigua and Barbuda government has reduced its consumption tax on fuel to ease the burden on consumers. To the point where it was actually negative and they have to actually pay West Indies oil um, that difference because of the negative um, to, to, to fund that shortfall. Georges was speaking during an interview last Thursday, three days after the country's latest increases at the pumps. Jamie J. Roche, ABS News.